What's the difference between a STEMI and a non-STEMI? Of course we can answer that for you. So you'll notice here on the, the anterior portions of this heart, you have your vessels, right? You have the vessels on the anterior portions here. So when we get a blockage in those vessels, so we have a blockage here, and that means we have decreased amount of blood flow that can pass this blockage. Well, what happens in that particular case, if you look at the muscle here, the vessels are here, what's gonna happen when we have that decrease of blood flow is that we're gonna have good blood flow on the exterior portions of this muscle, but the area furthest away from that vessel are going to be affected and infarct. That's where we get our non-STEMI presentations. It's simply saying that we're getting infarction from the furthest area away from that vessel, but not necessarily the entire musculature wall. That's the difference between a STEMI and a non-STEMI, because when we have a complete blockage here and no blood flow can get through, then the entire muscle is affected, not just a portion of it that we saw in a non-STEMI. Hey EMT students, if you love our videos here, then you're gonna love our illustrated notes. It's chock full of things like cheat sheets, anatomy physiology, and literally everything in between that you can imagine. This is 21 pages long, and it's chock full of really cool illustrated notes for you. If you would love this package, all you need to do is hit the link in our bio and download them from there.